This photo, taken in 1914, is one of the best loved in the Manchester High School archive. It shows a group of girls standing on the steps of the old school building in Dover Street. But what is the story behind the picture? And how does it connect with our theme of community? The girls were members of the school Golden Rule Society, which was set up in the 1890s. The motto of the society was Be you to others kind and true, and always unto others do as you would have others do to you. Our values today reflect this philosophy. The girls are carrying parcels of clothes which had been made at meetings of the Golden Rule Society to be given to people in need. But Manchester High has embraced the spirit of community from its foundation in 1874 right up to the present day. After all, it was founded by the Manchester community, by the citizens who donated money to set up an academic school for girls and to provide for Manchester's daughters what has been provided without stint for Manchester's sons. One of the first examples of support for the wider community was in 1888, when at a governor's meeting it was agreed that staff and girls could hold sewing meetings to make clothes for charity. The school made toys for Ancoats Hospital, the Royal Eye Hospital and the Withington Workhouse. The school magazine of June 1907 reports that the girls in the cookery class made 26 plum puddings, which were given to the eye hospital, 46 garments, some dress dolls and other toys were sent to the district nurses' home in Plymouth Grove to be distributed among sick children. Manchester High also supported the Manchester Babies Hospital, which opened in 1914. One of the founders was the school doctor, Dr Catherine Chisholm. The school magazine reports that in December 1928 a large parcel of woolies and bibs was taken to the hospital. At the Christmas party, every baby wore a new bib made by a Manchester High pupil. So Manchester High has always valued the spirit of community. But this is just the beginning of the story. There is so much more to tell. But that is for another day.